Ants are everywhere. These tiny creatures are some of the most ubiquitous and fascinating insects on our planet. They can be found in almost every corner of the world, from the hottest deserts to the lushest rainforests, and even in the cracks of our city sidewalks. Their presence is a testament to their incredible adaptability and resilience. In gardens, forests, and even our homes, these tiny creatures scurry about, diligently going about their business. They're constantly on the move, foraging for food, building nests, and tending to their young. Each ant has a specific role to play within their colony, and they perform their duties with remarkable efficiency and coordination. We often see them carrying crumbs, leaves, or even other ants many times their size. This incredible strength is one of the most astonishing aspects of their behavior. An ant can lift and carry objects that are up to 50 times its own body weight. Imagine a human being able to lift a car with the same ease. But have you ever stopped to wonder about the intricate workings of these tiny marvels? Their lives are a complex web of interactions and activities that are essential for the survival of their colony. From the moment they hatch, ants are assigned specific roles such as workers, soldiers or queens, each contributing to the colony's success. Their bodies, though small, are complex machines, perfectly adapted for survival. Ants have powerful mandibles that they use for cutting, carrying and defending. Their exoskeletons provide protection and support while their antennae are essential for communication and navigation. These adaptations make ants incredibly efficient and effective in their roles. Ants, despite their size, are incredibly strong. Their strength is not just physical, but also lies in their ability to work together. Cooperation is key to their success. When faced with a challenge, ants will join forces, using their combined strength to move large objects or build intricate structures. This teamwork is a fundamental aspect of their survival strategy. They can carry objects many times their own weight and work together in large numbers to achieve impressive feats. This collaborative effort is not just about brute strength, it also involves sophisticated communication and coordination. Ants use chemical signals, known as pheromones, to relay information and coordinate their activities. This allows them to work together seamlessly, almost as if they were a single organism. Their success lies in their remarkable anatomy and social structure. Ant colonies are highly organized societies with each member playing a specific role. This division of labor ensures that all necessary tasks are completed efficiently. The queen lays eggs, the workers care for the young and gather food, and the soldiers defend the colony. This social structure, combined with their physical adaptations, makes ants one of the most successful groups of insects on the planet. Like all insects, ants have a body divided into three main parts, the head, the thorax and the abdomen. Each of these sections plays a crucial role in the ant's life, from sensing the environment to gathering food and defending the colony. This three-part body plan is a hallmark of insects and it has been incredibly successful in allowing them to colonize almost every habitat on Earth. The ant's body, though small, is a marvel of evolution. The ant's head is its primary sensory center. Here you'll find its eyes, antennae, and mouth parts. The eyes, though small, help the ant navigate its surroundings and detect changes in light. Some species even have compound eyes, which allow them to see a wider field of view. The mouth parts, including the powerful mandibles, are used for a variety of tasks, such as carrying food, digging, and defense. These mandibles are incredibly strong for their size allowing ants to manipulate objects much larger than themselves. Perhaps the most important sensory organs on the ant's head are its antenna. These long, thin appendages are covered in tiny sensors that detect chemicals in the air. This is how ants smell, and it's their primary mode of communication. Ants use pheromones, chemical signals released from their bodies to communicate with each other. These signals can indicate food trails, danger, or even the location of a new nest site. Section five, the thorax, an engine for legs and wings. The thorax is the middle section of the ant's body and it's responsible for locomotion. This crucial part of the ant's anatomy acts as a central hub, coordinating the movement of its legs and in some species, its wings. The thorax is a marvel of biological engineering designed to support the ant's active lifestyle. 
Attached to the thorax are three pairs of legs which give ants their remarkable agility and speed. These legs are not just for walking, they are highly specialized tools that allow ants to perform a variety of tasks. From running at impressive speeds to climbing vertical surfaces and even jumping between obstacles, the legs are a testament to the ants' adaptability. Some species also have wings, at least for part of their lives. These wings are typically present during the reproductive phase, allowing ants to disperse and establish new colonies. The presence of wings adds another layer of complexity to the thorax, as it must support both flight and ground-based locomotion. The powerful muscles in the thorax power the ant's legs, allowing it to run, climb and even jump. These muscles are incredibly efficient, providing the necessary force for the ant to navigate its environment with ease. Whether it's sprinting across the forest floor or scaling a tree trunk, the thorax is the engine that drives these movements. These legs are also covered in tiny hairs and spines that help the ant grip onto surfaces. The hairs increase friction, making it easier for the ant to hold onto slippery or uneven surfaces. The spines provide additional grip, ensuring that the ant can maintain its hold even in challenging conditions. This combination of features makes the ant's legs incredibly versatile and effective tools for survival. The thorax is not just a powerhouse for individual ants, it also plays a crucial role in the collective efforts of the colony. The coordinated movements of worker ants, driven by their thoracic muscles, enable them to carry heavy loads, build intricate nests and communicate through touch and movement. This collective strength is one of the reasons ants are such successful and resilient creatures. In conclusion, the thorax is a vital component of the ant's anatomy, serving as the engine for both legs and wings. Its design and functionality are key to the ant's ability to thrive in diverse environments, from dense forests to bustling urban areas. The thorax's remarkable capabilities highlight the incredible adaptability and resilience of ants, making them one of the most fascinating and successful groups of insects on the planet. Section 6. The abdomen, a container for vital organs. The abdomen is the final section of the ant's body, and it houses the ant's vital organs, including its heart, digestive system, and reproductive organs. The abdomen also plays a crucial role in communication. Some ants have a stinger at the tip of their abdomen, which they use for defense. The stinger injects venom that can paralyze prey or deter predators. Section 7, Specialized Ants, Specialized Adaptations. The ant world is incredibly diverse with over 12,000 known species. Each species has unique adaptations that allow it to thrive in its particular environment. Leaf cutter ants, for example, have powerful jaws for cutting leaves, which they use to cultivate fungus for food. Army ants are nomadic hunters, forming massive raiding parties that overwhelm their prey. Weaver ants, on the other hand, use silk produced by their larvae to weave together leaves and create intricate nests. Section 8, Societies of Ants, a symphony of roles. Ants are highly social insects, living in colonies that can range in size from a few dozen individuals to millions. Within a colony, there is a clear division of labor with different ants performing specific roles. The queen is responsible for laying eggs while the workers perform all the other tasks necessary for the colony's survival, such as foraging for food, caring for the young, and defending the nest. Section 9. Communication, the language of ants. Ants communicate with each other primarily through pheromones, chemical signals that they release into the environment. These pheromones can convey a wide range of information from the location of food sources to the presence of danger. Ants also communicate through touch and sound. For example, they may tap each other with their antennae or stridulate, which is the act of producing sound by rubbing body parts together. Section 10. The adaptable ant, a testament to evolution. Ants are found on every continent except Antarctica, showcasing their incredible ability to thrive in diverse environments. They inhabit a wide range of habitats, from the scorching deserts to the lush rainforests, demonstrating their versatility. Their success is a testament to their remarkable adaptability, which has been honed over millions of years of evolution. Their small size allows them to navigate through the tiniest of spaces, and their social organization is a marvel of nature. 
Ants have the ability to exploit a wide range of resources from leaves and seeds to other insects, making them incredibly resourceful. This resourcefulness, combined with their complex social structures, has allowed them to become one of the most successful groups of animals on Earth. Next time you see an ant, take a moment to appreciate the complexity and wonder of these tiny creatures. Each ant you see is part of a larger colony, working together in perfect harmony to ensure the survival and success of their community. They build intricate nests and tunnels, often extending deep underground, showcasing their engineering prowess. Ants are also fierce defenders of their colonies, willing to fight off predators and protect their queen at all costs. Some species even farm other insects like aphids for food and tend to their young with great care. Their communication is primarily through pheromones, leaving scent trails that guide other ants to food sources or alert them to danger. The collaborative effort of ants is a true testament to the power of teamwork and social cooperation. From the smallest backyard to the vast wilderness, ants continue to thrive and adapt, reminding us of the incredible power of evolution. So the next time you encounter these industrious insects, remember the remarkable journey they have undertaken to become one of nature's most successful survivors.